Hello guys, Lance here, and today I'm going to be doing a video on my brand new Skag Tiger Cat 2. I actually just purchased this because I started my own uh, landscaping business, but I did one mod to it. I added some lights. So stay tuned and I'll show you how I put these on. Okay, so first I ordered these 5D pods off of Amazon. I also ordered some Skag Cat Eye uh, orange spray paint and I color match these to the same color of the mower because I think it looks really good the reason I bought these is because some yards I cut it's getting right at dark when I'm trying to finish and sometimes you just need like 10 more minutes of cutting and you'll be done so these really help because you can finish the yards up and I'll have to come back another day so uh, basically all I did was buy these pods I took them apart and uh, painted the outsides of them and uh, then I put them back together and mounted them on here the way I mounted them uh, this is the only place I found that would really work without having to drill nothing or cut anything into the frame I didn't want to drill no holes or nothing so what I did is right here on this bolt that holds the frame to the wheel assembly I, uh, I took it out and the uh, pod came with these brackets. The brackets actually had to drill a hole a little more offset than center to make it be able to fit in here like this. But it did work very well and I'm very happy with it. How I wired them up, I just ran the wires down through here and then ran them across the frame. And then right here, I spliced them together from the two pods and ran my wires directly up under the uh, deck set pedal height and then up through here somewhere you can't really see it well and then I just ran it to a cigarette switch uh, this is because I didn't want to have to drill into the control panel right here so this worked very well and all you have to do is flip the switch then turn on flip it turn then turn off and you don't have to drill no holes or nothing you may be asking do these get in your way while you're cutting uh, I, so far I've had no problems uh, trees and stuff usually go in here and they don't touch nothing over here and your wheels protect it on that side also your brake pedal here you push it all the way up and release it so you're not touching the lights by no means on that side and your deck pedal you're not touching it by nothing over there now for what they look like whoa that's bright as you can tell, they're extremely bright, and they just look wonderful on this mower. I've seen the halogen kits that you can buy for the Skag. Uh, can't even compare to how bright these are. And they mount up by the uh, gas tank, so you're not getting as much of a coverage out front. But that's going to be it for today, guys. Thanks for watching, and as always, subscribe to my channel, like, and comment if you have any questions.